Can a supervillain still be a good parent? What say you? Absolutely. I mean, I think that what's so, what I love about this show so much is that all of the characters feel very re defined and three-dimensional and you understand who they are. And then, especially with the parents, then you learn that their supervillains are more complex, but it becomes, it's, it's much more difficult to just sort of brand them with good or bad because you know all the stuff that happens at home. It's not just like, superhero stuff and that's it. You get to see kind of all of their layers and, and dimensions. I think we're good parents. I think so too. I think that... Um, we're loving. Yeah, I think we're loving. We're trying to teach independence. Yeah. Um, and by the way, I don't even think we think we're supervillains. Partly, I think I would almost, you know, challenge that notion of a like, super you know, what's a supervillain? Right. You know? Uh, that's, that was my first reaction, was like, yeah. you say supervillain, I say you know, determined. Determined, I'd, I'd say there's Goal things oriented. in life, there are things in life that you just have to do to, uh, for the, ultimately, the, the, the thing you care about the most. You know, which I feel um, like for all the parents is family. Is family, and yeah. and everything we do comes out of, I think, that uh, need that primal need and, and to, desire to yeah, protect your nest, protect mm -hmm. your family, and see to what's best for your kids. And they know? may not agree. <laughs> Part of the the reason why we've kind of waded into those supervillain waters is because we want to be good parents. Yeah. Um, sometimes as a parent you put in a situation where you have to make a <laughs> powerful choice uh, to benefit your, your well, child. Make and, some uh, compromises yeah. and some decisions and yeah. as long as he does what we want him to do, there won't be any problem. <laughs> oh, gosh, I think we both fall on the same lines, of the same side of that debate. Yeah. I mean that's kind of what this show is, where everybody is convinced that evil is evil and good is good. And, and that, the show starts off that way. I mean, every kid thinks that their parents are evil. What if they really are? And in so many ways, we are mm -hmm. evil. Mm -hmm. And we do some horrible things. But this show brings in the humanity to that and makes, as, as Annie just said, makes you realize why they're making these types of decisions. Mm -hmm. And I think while doing really horrible, horrible things, it's always pretty clear, at least in, in Leslie's viewpoint, what, why she's doing it, why she's going down that path, why she's doing these horrible things. And I think a supervillain is way more interesting if you also at sometimes kind of feel for them and kind of think, oh gosh, I kind of think they're right in this situation. And that's something that I've, I've really enjoyed about uh, reading Marvel comics uh, all my life, um, is that the villains are very well motivated. You can understand why they're doing what they're doing. And you, you get to learn about the pain that led them on a path toward hurting people. Which is not to say that later on they may, got, they may not get off that path and stop doing that. Most of them don't, let's be honest. No, but nothing's but, simple. There's, yeah. yeah. It's not like, the, you know, like a, a Marvel villain just wakes up and goes, I will destroy the world, you know? Uh, something happens to them and they, they actually think that they're either protecting themselves or helping, but they're not. And I feel like Josh and Steph are so great at, at doing that and giving nuance and likability to characters that you're not really supposed to like, but then all of a sudden you're kind of rooting for them about some things or feeling really emotionally connected to a person that you're like, God, why do I care about you so much? Um, so I think in this show in particular, 100% a supervillain. Can be a great parent. Can be a great parent. And it's fun to play, it's fun to play a supervillain. Yeah. Who, who loves their kid more than anything in the world, you know? Mm -hmm. Although you're not really in pride. Hey. <laughs>